Oh. What the hell is my camera doing in the refrigerator? <laughs> uh, nah, but getting some coffee creamer. Um, a lot of people, they say that you can't drink coffee creamer when you're trying to be in shape. I say bullshit. You're counting macros, guys. This thing has one half gram of fat, five carbs, zero protein. So, not that much. You don't need that much to put in your coffee. I don't drink black coffee. I never will. I'm not gonna be the one to tell you to drink black coffee because it tastes like shit. And what's the point of drinking something that tastes like shit? So, I'm gonna put my phone back in the refrigerator and go to the gym, so. I don't know why they been lying, but your shit is not that inspiring. Bank account statement just look like I'm ready for early retirement. Okay, now you're talking my language. Now you're talking my language. Now you're talking my language, now you're talking my language. What's going on guys, so, I Walmart. Didn't record the workout, cause there's way too much going on in the gym. So, we're at the Walmart right now, getting some things for breakfast. This girlfriend right there. Damn, them back muscles though. <laughs> but yeah, so, I'll show you guys uh, what we make when we get back. We're just picking up some butter and stuff, so, yeah. Went to Walmart and apparently they have Quest bars now selling at Walmart. So for all you guys who don't know, I was on Quest a lot. I was eating Quest bars so much, but now, oh yeah, bars are like freaking shit. I don't care what anybody says. But yeah, I got the mint one. Today is the next day. Um, right now, I'm already dressed for the gym and everything, but we have to go to the gas station. I gotta get some fucking gas. But yeah, so we plan on going to the gym. I'm waiting for Ashley, because she's gonna record me. Um, around like 4.30ish, so right now it's one o'clock. I've been up already for a while already, but uh, it's kind of like starting everything out. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get this gas and uh, probably get like a, a oh yeah bar or something. And uh, yeah, I will take you guys throughout my workout. Today's gonna be chest and chest. We'll do, we're gonna do chest and arms. So that's a little bit new. We're gonna do chest and arms today. Also, in my first video of Lean Gains, the, the series Lean Gains, where I, you know, bulk for in a lean phase. Basically, in the first video, I just wanna put this clear. I said I was an affiliate with Alpha Pack Fitness. Now, I just wanna let you guys know, cause I'm being 100% straight up with you guys uh, in all these videos, that basically I ended that. Because one, why did I end this? So one, I ended it actually a while back, probably like around like five videos. So I actually ended it um, about five videos ago because I wasn't in love with the brand, you know what I'm saying? So if you're gonna be sponsored or affiliate with something, first of all, you do have to become an affiliate unless you straight up become the sponsored, uh, which is very rare. But first of all, if you become an affiliate with someone, you have to love the product, right? So you have to be willing to buy it before they even like try something with you, you know what I'm saying? So if you can't do that, if you don't see yourself buying the product, like if you weren't part of them, then you shouldn't be with them because you know you have to put in the same amount of effort as you know they are and you have to really love it and you're, you're kind of selling the product so it's like you have but you have to be able to love it and wear it even though if you weren't a sponsored athlete with it you know what i'm saying so ended that because i'm not in love with it and it's not like a real contract type of deal thingy uh sponsored thing so you know i'm not gonna run with it plus you know like i said i'm not in love with it so I'm not gonna, I've came to realization that I'm not going to rep something that I'm not proud of, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's it with that. Uh, but I'm at the gas station right now, so I'm gonna put some gas in this baby and we're gonna get it going on guys. So I'm about to go to the gym, but for right now, I am putting some creatine in before. I've already had a monster. So like just maybe like 10 minutes ago, and it actually takes about 10 to 45 minutes for caffeine to kick in right after you consume it <laughs> so yeah
that's a fun fact for you guys. But yeah, going to go to the gym, putting some creatine in. Um, this is about five milligrams. I can just I've been taking it for a long ass time, so I kind of know what five milligrams is already. So gonna go. Yes, I'm wearing this shirt again. The only reason is because I wash it, so it's my favorite shirt. I don't have that many gym shirts, and you don't need a freaking outfit to go to the gym, so just for you guys. What's good, YouTube? So, starting this workout off, I wanted to get done with this workout. Um, I freaking killed my chest uh, today when I was doing this workout. Basically, uh, it was a high volume. Um, I did some supersets in between there, and I was just very... I was stimulated, stimulating the hell out of my muscles. So this is mostly a chest day and some triceps. So you see me right here doing an incline. Um, the way my chest days are consistent of, basically the first chest day, cause I do it for like, for like two weeks. So the first chest day of that first week, I will do dumbbells. The second week I will do barbells. So usually when I do the barbells, I will start off with, um, just regular flat bench but when i'm doing dumbbells i always start off incline no matter what um it's just something that i have progressed with and it works with me so hey if it ain't broke don't fix it um right here you see me doing a superset right here it is a flat bench with some dumbbells i believe it's a 65 pounds um so not that much but the superset is what kills it afterwards right after it i go to uh, some dumbbell chest flies um as you see right here um and I did 15 reps. So this is only a 15 pound right here. And I did 15 reps um, right after I did my flat bench. So killed it. Um, I want you guys to enjoy the rest of the workout. I also wanted you guys to see, um, I just wanted you guys to know that I wasn't a part of that company anymore as of my first video. Um, I kind of am going solo now. So just want to see where that takes me. And yeah guys, so enjoy the rest of the video. Um, this is some raw footage. And I'm also teaching you guys on some um, stuff that I do with my triceps and uh, chest, etc. So right here doing decline, but I will see you guys in the rest of the video, enjoy. So we're about to do a tricep movement that I learned uh, a long time ago, and uh, it's, a, it's basically a drop set, but you want to do 15 reps and then 15 seconds in between. So you do 15 reps, 15 seconds of rest, 15, 15 reps again, 15 seconds of rest, and so on and so on. But we're going to do that for five sets. Just pick any type of weight that you can do for 15, like I'm doing, looks like it's 32 pounds, so not the heavy, but 15 reps, five sets, it's going to get tricky. So we just rested, so 15 minutes. Thank you. 
I do some chest flies, the machine one. But as you guys know, I don't grab this. I'm grab the button. You go front, because you, you, when you do these dips, if you lean front, you're gonna work straight in your chest. If you go, if you just lean straight up, you're gonna work triceps. So what I'm gonna do to work both, is do a slight lean, and work both. Actually, becoming one of my favorite tricep movements. Uh, you might think this looks like a bitch movement, um, but if you're with the weights up and your form is good, because when you do this, your elbows are gonna want to come up like just like this. The whole point is to keep them on the pad. So right now I'm doing 90 pounds. How you got So. guys so just ended that workout uh, it was very high intensity high volume workout so um, yeah right now we're going to Best Buy uh, someone came up to me again and just like straight up went off elite shirt and I'm just like yeah bruh sure <laughs> Not obvious. Uh, yeah so going to Best Buy right now I got my girlfriend right behind me uh, she needs to go get her phone fixed because she broke her iPhone. Um, iPhones are so like known for broke for breaking so damn easy. But she didn't drop it or anything. She like broke it on purpose. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna go do that, get that done. And uh, this is gonna be the end of the video. So I hope you enjoyed it all. Um, subscribe if you have not already. I'm vlogging right now and uh, fucking while I'm driving. So this isn't safe. I don't have my seatbelt on. <laughs> But yeah guys so subscribe and like this video please like this video share it to any of your friends um you know guys so also i want to tell you guys that oh she want to race <laughs> i just want to tell you guys that um i'm this is basically like i'm cutting right now so this today right now if you're watching this video i'm cutting this is the first time like i'm cutting right now like getting prepared for my show and everything like that um so 
I might compete even before October. We'll see if everything goes good because I know I only need like maybe like two months just to cut and I'll be freaking shredded. So that's what's happening right now. So yeah, guys, expect a lot of tips coming over to you on how to cut, what's going on. Um, honestly, I don't even do that much cardio to get to the, where the condition that like, I'm really good at. So I just do a lot of ab movements and my your, your diet needs to be on point. So I'll show you guys what's good, what's going on with my diet and everything like that. Um, but yeah, so stay tuned, subscribe. And yeah, guys, I love you guys. So peace.